Hi, I'm Norma Family, and I'm Lanny Marchand, Team Canada Olympian in the Marathon and 10,000 meters. Today I'm going to take you through a quick warm up and then two separate circuits. Let's get it. Okay, before we get going with our circuits, we're going to do a quick warm up. The first exercise in our warm up series is going to be an ankle mobility and hip opener. To do this, we're just going to start in a kneeling lunge position. I'm going to drive through that back glute, getting a deep knee bend in that lead leg which is gonna really allow me to get a nice stretch into my calf and down into that ankle. The second exercise in our warm-up series is going to be heel sits to hip extension. To do that, I'm gonna start kneeling with my knees a little bit wider than my hips. I'm gonna sit back on my heels and then drive up and forward using my glutes to really press and get a full stretch in the front of my hips. Our third warm-up exercise is going to be an adductor stretch. To do this, you're gonna start kneeling. Extend one leg out to the side, hands on your hips. You're gonna sit back on your heel and then drive up and forward, getting a full stretch in the front of your hips and through the inside of that leg, doing 20 each side. We're up on our feet for our final warm-up exercise. This one's a hip opener, single leg. So I'm gonna stand on one leg, press into that heel and really make sure that glute is turned on. I'm gonna draw knee circles in one direction. 10 times, and then 10 circles in the opposite direction. Now that we're all warmed up, we can go into our first circuit. The first exercise is a single leg RDL. You can do this with just your body weight. I'm gonna stand on one leg, drive that knee up. I'm gonna hinge back, kicking that leg behind me, having a nice slight bend in my standing leg. I'm gonna drive up and then press my hand up over my head. The second exercise in our balance circuit is a single leg overhead halo. To do this exercise with just body weight, I'm gonna stand on one leg, make sure that glute is really strong and activated, drive my other knee up, take both hands, clasp them together, and either bent arms or straight arms, draw circles over my head 12 times clockwise and 12 times counterclockwise. Okay, so now we're at our final exercise in the balance series. This is a torso hoop. You're gonna do this single legged. For this, you do need an object that you can pass around your trunk. You're gonna stand in a single leg position and pass the object 12 times clockwise around my torso and 12 times counterclockwise before I switch sides. Okay, now we're ready for our final circuit. The first exercise is a two-legged RDL. I'm gonna drop back, hinging at my waist, and then using my glutes, I'm gonna power back up into that full hip extended position we warmed up with. We're gonna do this exercise 12 times. Our second exercise has us dropping down into the ground. We're gonna do a push-up into a rotating T position. Start in a push-up plank. Drop down, press up, rotate over and follow that arm up to the sky. The third exercise in our strength series are calf raises. You can do this with two feet. We're gonna do 12 calf raises, making sure we're pressing through our glutes down into our toes to rise up, drop down, Our fourth exercise in the strength series has us lying down on one side. We want our hips stacked. I'm gonna drop my top leg slightly behind me and using that glute and pressing through my heel, I'm gonna lift that leg up and down 12 times before I switch sides. The final exercise in our strength series is going to be a squat to overhead press. To do this with just body weight, I'm gonna stand with my feet slightly wider than hip width when I drop down in the squat, I'm gonna hinge at my hips. I'm gonna drop my butt down and back. And then I'm gonna press through my heels and my glutes and press up and put my arms up overhead. Okay, thanks everyone for working out with me today. Make sure and log your workout on the MyFitnessPal app.